YouTube, welcome back to a new video, and uh, as you can see on my screen, today I'm going to show you guys how to make a cartoon style horror UI. Um, I really like, I actually made this a while ago, I forgot when, but I think it was over a year ago, at least. But um, as you can see, the idea is pretty cool, um, it's perfect for you know, a simulator, a cartoony game, uh, the colors, it's just really clean. But this was a while ago, so you see there are imperfections um, that could be done a lot better. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to show you guys how to make this, and we're also going to improve it since this was made a long time ago. Alright, so let's start. Um, let's make these little buttons on the side. Let's make a new layer, and I'm going to use my rounded rectangle tool right here, and my radius is, uh, let's, let's try 10. Make sure your fill is on right here, so black box and the stroke is off. So make sure you guys check out our store, gfxcomment.com. Uh, we now have studio imported products. Well, we have one, but we have a lot more coming soon. So yeah, just check it out. We have some free stuff, some UIs, graphics packs. Just check it out for yourself. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video, uh, this red slash. Make sure you have our settings uh, like mine. So, okay, click and hold and then hold shift and alt and then when you drag out it should be uh, proportional like this all right now i'm just gonna pick uh, double click choose the color so we have our nice purple all right so we have this okay now you want to hold alt drag this down and uh, let go this is going to make a copy and then you can move it down Double click and select a darker shade. Um, this should work. Alright, there we go. So we have that. Alright, now to make this little goo thing is actually pretty simple. So here's how you make that. So make a new layer. And right here, we're going to use our pencil. Okay. And let's go to shape, fill on, stroke off. And now we're just gonna click right here, okay? And then we're gonna click and drag to this direction. All right, now we're just gonna click here, drag a little bit, click right here and drag. And then, hold on, click here and drag here as well. And then right here. So now we have uh, the shape. Let's double click and click on the middle color because now we're gonna copy it. So Control J, we're gonna right click and we're gonna go create clipping mask like this. Now we double click on this one, select the lighter shade and move this up. And now we could copy this layer. So hold Alt, drag it down, move it down, double click, and we're gonna select on the darker shade. So now we have our little goo, as you can see. Um, let's hide this. Take these three, group it up, so Control G. And you can copy and paste it, so Control J. Move it, Control T, hold Alt, resize, right click, flip horizontal. So now we have some goo on our button. And now, um, let's see. I think I want to control T. I want to scale this up because I want to add a stroke. I want to see how this looks. Yeah, I like that. Actually, looks good. Um, all right, darker shade. So like this, like this right here. All right, I want to see how this looks if I add the stroke to the goo. Actually looks pretty good. I like it. All right. Um. To add the little stripes, uh, it's actually very simple. So, make a new layer. Use a rectangle tool. Uh, color is black, and you're just going to draw some rectangles like this. Hold Alt and Shift. Drag it down. It's gonna make a copy. Drag it down again, and again, and again. Now hold Shift. Click on all these. Control E to merge and uh, all right, 
right click, create clean mask, make sure it's on top of uh, this layer. And now we could, <laughs> now we could resize this and rotate. So now we got this, okay. Boom, there we go. Now we have our basic button. Uh, you could group all this up. So let's go one button, we're gonna copy after we group it up. Copy, and then we could copy this and make these little uh, currency things, which is basically just us resizing it. So, very simple. Just something like that. It's perfect. And this thing, just copy and paste it. And this. Alright. <laughs> and these are just gonna go right here. There we go. And now we have our side buttons, as you can see. It looks really nice. Alright, um, I'm using a nighttime background. And as you can see, it stands out so much more. It looks uh, a lot more appropriate. But now let's get to the main part, uh, which is the My Pets section. And uh, yeah, we're going to improve on this and make this a lot better because this, while it works for most games, it, in terms of UI, it's not the best. <laughs> so, okay, let's make a new layer. Use our eyedropper and select on the purple here. And let's use our rounded rectangle tool right here. Radius to scale for 20, I think. We're just gonna draw out a little panel like this. All right, I'm gonna do 35. I wanna see how it looks. The more round you make, you make this, the more cartoony it looks. As you can see, oops. So this one is actually quite round. If you want to go for like 50, like that. <laughs> yeah, I guess you could, but. All right, so we have the My Pet section. Uh, we have the goo on the top. All right, so let's use this again. And uh, let's make a new layer. Let's go up top, like this right here. Let's make this dark gray. There we go. Now let's add some text. So, for my pets. I'll make this extra bold. All right, I'm gonna try to make this clean. So, <laughs> let's go right here. All right, some little adjustments because I want to keep this clean. I'm gonna make it weird. Should I use capitals for this? I don't know. Probably, right? My pets. Okay, I think this whole thing is a bit, a bit too big. Let's go down. Is better. All right, now we have pets capacity X one. First of all, let's add the goo. So copy and paste this out. Let's take these. I'm gonna place these right. Just like that. <laughs> Obviously, you could do a uh, better job, but I think that's fine. Um, all right, now we have the name sort by. Okay, so new layer, run rectangle tool. All right, select on the purple. Let's go for a slightly darker shade. Actually, we gotta add the text first. So actually. We'll do that after, so we just section it off like that, and we just go like this. All right, for this, we could also add a stroke, so 
All right, we can see. Um, I'm gonna take the layer cell of this group of the goo with the stroke, and I'm just gonna paste it. So we have that. Okay, that looks nice. I like that. I'm trying to figure out how I wanna do this part right here. Um. Right, I'm really thinking so, so right here is where you're gonna make your little section for what pets you own. So I'm gonna copy and paste these. Three and four. Alright. And that is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I'm going to see you guys in the next video.